prepared by Professor Lee in ocean engineering, but I use this one for the next time. It was two years more than uh, what is it? So I will cover only wind part today. And Mino will cover tidal wave. Okay. And then next week we will cover part two. So you already know that renewable energy coming from natural resource, and such as sunlight, wind, and rain, tidal, and wave, and geothermal. So there is all kind of here. Uh, starting from sun, every energy coming from the air. So you can see that there is a big, big amount of energy. Half of them from sun, but we, we not easy. And raining and water, so hydroelectric power, right? And also uh, wind power. Wind is blowing. And wave here, tidal energy, and radiation, solar radiation. Yeah. So wind energy. Wind resources, the sun gives all the powers, all the energies, big number, big 11 powers. And to the earth, per hour, this is only per hour. So very big number energy is coming. And wind is a byproduct of solar energy. So all the energy is coming. Yeah. Approximately 2%, only 2% of this number reaching the earth is converted into wind energy. Still, wind energy is only 2%, but still big enough. Right? So another easier example growing is solar energy converted into 2% wind energy. No, this one is wind energy, right? Wind energy and geothermal energy and global con consumption is only trillion watt. So that this one is big enough if we can convert this one into consumable energy. Right, in this is a far eastern area. So Japan is here. Korea Peninsula and China, uh, Russia, and this is a wind map. Also, this is a Korea Peninsula is over there. So wind is good in around Jeju Island and also near the Busan port. So this is a good place for wind energy. Once again, same picture in different form. So when Hot is wind is good blowing around Jeju Island and, and Busan port. So there are some some uh, already uh, wind uh, uh, power system. This is looks like uh, Hangwon is in Jeju Island, and Daegwonleung is in the mountainside, high mountainside. So you see that this is Jeju Island, and high mountains, but as I explained before, the size is become growing. Right? That is uh, the limitation to the land side of uh, installation. Usually the limitation goes up to one megawatt. That is the maximum size usually already installed in, in, in South Korea many, many reasons. But main reason coming from uh, land consumption and also noise coming from the system. Why wind power? Good things, the low is priced. So it's, uh, economically, comparing to other source, solar or and wave and other geothermal, wind is cheaper to convert right, today technology. And the trend is lightweight 
lower solidity and more flexibility, so larger diameter. And passive load relief, this is a very interesting problem. Something like a band twist coupled system. Uh, can you remember when you visit the uh, Eureka building? We, we, we had a class once, right? And at the first floor, there is a wind turbine is rotating. Can you remember this? Right. About this size is inside the building, first floor, there's a wind is rotating. But you may not notice that the, the blade shape is not straight. A little bit bended. That was uh, one of the research produced, and we call this a BTC blade. BTC blade. Uh, when the wind is very high, something like a storm is coming, and then the wind speed is too high that the design condition is exceeded. What happened with the high wind coming to the in the power system, the blade can be break because of the too high speed of wind. Right? So what can be the measure at that time? Because sometimes it, it is coming. Typhoon is coming to the Korea in the summer time, several times. Right? So they usually do by rotating the blade so that they change the angle of attack to reduce so maybe you, you can use, say, wind is, uh, when the, they rotate, they usually facing. You can expect, expect the uh, uh, wind blow, wind blow. The face is facing toward you, right? To produce wind to the body. So it's same as the wind rotating in this way. But if you rotate in this way, then very small effect to the blade, right? Even though wind is coming. So, so the, by twisting, twisting or angle of attack, they can relieve. So this is a low load relief mechanism. But now they are say it is active rotation, active control, right? When the wind is high, they control the blades orientation by motor at the hub side, controlling. Pitch angle right? or angle of attack. But this one, the, the system we, you saw in the entrance of the Eureka building, the blade is designed in such way that they bend naturally. Because of the wind is high, the system is bent in this direction so that the Automatically, angle of attack is reduced. That is the trend uh, in, in new design. Passive load relief or BTC blade. So they do not use a uh, motor there right, to rotate this. The more critical problem is the sensor system. Right? When the high wind is coming, they should sense and then control. Right? The, the, the control loop, control loop. But if you have a passive control, you don't need such a system. Naturally, they bend to, to, to rotate the blade angle of attack. Right, and material for blade and then Euro is more installation, right? But Asia is increasing and North America is increasing fastly. It is a little bit old date. 10 years old, wind energy, right? The mechanism is, you see that this is blade and it, there is a tower and this is a generator here inside. Right? So we call this a nut cell, nut cell, uh, a room, big room, right? Generator room. So inflow of wind and then inflow of wind activate a blade, so blade rotating Rotation is goes into shaft. Yeah. Rotor, blade, blade, and rotor spin the main shaft. 
and gearbox, gearbox to increase RPM, right? The RPM is slow for the whole blade system. So increase the RPM, then generate, and generate electricity. And electricity go down to this one. So it's a gearbox and generator here, right? Simple. And orientation. Usually you expect this, we call this a horizontal axis in the power system, horizontal axis. This is a horizontal. Horizontal parallel with the wind, wind direction, right? Wind direction, so we, we call this is a horizontal system, horizontal axis. But there is also another type, vertical axis. Wind is blowing in this way. So axis is a vertical. But nowadays, this is more popular. Right, right size, 10 megawatt. 10 megawatt, diameter is 180 meter. 180 meter. How tall is the building? How tall is the building? Five, five floor. Right? Five meter, 25, 25. This building, 25 meter. 25 is only <laughs> 100 kilowatts, the diameter of blade. Right? So this building size of our blade is rotating, generate only 100 or 300 kilowatts. But 180 meter is rotating. 180 meter is how many floors there? 36 floor building, right? It's rotated. So bigger, bigger. So that they cannot accommodate in the land size. They should put into the ocean. One more, 20 megawatt. This is, so current situation is, this one is commercialized already. You can buy if you have a money. You can buy from company of this size. This size. This one is on the edge of commercialization. So this, within one or two years, you can buy this size. Right? It's a big one. Diameter. This is a, only under development stage. 20 megawatt. 300 meter diameter. 280. Big, bigger and bigger, right? And size of turbine, small, 10 kilowatt, and 100 kilowatt. So they can use for the home, only single home, or pumping, ice making, telecommunication size. But this is for village, whole village, small village, or hybrid means, uh, combined with the solar and wind and wave and you know remote site of island where there is no cable coming from the mainland they need some kind of a self generation of electricity and there they use a hybrid system why because wind blowing not always right not 24 hours they they blows but not always Sunshine, only say less than 10 hours, right? Sunshine. Right? Other mechanism too. So they, they need to have a steady, steady flow of electricity. So they need collect electricity through solar, wind, and other sources. And then you also need a good uh, storage system, battery. Big battery. They call it hybrid system. Large, large, five megawatt. Good. Question. No. So uh, we cannot do discussion today. But anyway, second lecture, please. Kevin.